Kenny Atkinson hey. got hired. Another Golden State assistant got hired. The other one got hired at NBA Siberia. I don't have to talk about him. Mm-hmm. Uh, you know, he went to Sacramento. My condolences. Yeah, that's it. My condolences to Mike Brown. But um, Kenny Atkinson gets hired with the Charlotte Hornets, and I personally believe that that's probably one of the ideal fits when you talk about roster, mm-hmm. construction, mm-hmm. young players, and then you have a head coach who is a development guru. Yeah. You saw what he did in Brooklyn with those kids over there. Mm-hmm. You see that you know Brooklyn was able to then trade those young players to go get their superstar get players, right? right? But I think Kenny Atkinson is going to take Melo to another level. I think he's going to take Mikael Bridges to another level. I mean, uh, excuse me, Miles Bridges to another mm-hmm. level. Like, there, there's so much potential for those guys to grow. Yeah. And I think finally we're going to start seeing the Charlotte Hornets be, they possibly, possibly may be the Memphis Grizzlies of the East. I can agree with that. They can have that ability. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, what are your thoughts on Kenny Atkinson getting the job? You know, Kenny Atkinson always reminded me of, like, the guidance counselor that smoked too many cigarettes. <laughs> right. That's the way he looks to me. <laughs> like, he gives you advice, and it's like, why are you giving me advice when you look like you go, you're going through it? But mm-hmm. he's a great coach. He's yeah. a great coach. He's a great coach, man. You saw what he did with D'Angelo, man. Yeah. I'm, yeah. I'm like, you know, no fandom. Obviously, I'm just, just basketball talk. Right. I love this move for the Hornets, man. Yeah. He's going to bring out even more out of LaMelo, man. Yeah, I agree. Like, I agree. Then he's going to have him playing defense. You know how he do with that. I agree. You know what I'm saying? I, I love the move, man. You know, Jordan, you know, people say what they want. That was a small move. That was a small move. He doesn't make a lot of them. But he don't make a lot of them, but this one, I like. Especially in regards to his attire. You ever seen how Jordan dressed? Listen, man. Baggy, <laughs> baggy suits, man. I've never That's, seen... Baggy cut jeans. Listen, I've never seen that. Jordan. I've never seen that. Jordan. Jordan's the only dude I know (laughs) that wears baggy cut jeans. Listen, man. With shoes. We'll we'll laugh at Jordan. (laughs) We'll laugh at Jordan for that. But it's Jordan, man. Let him slide. And listen, for years, too, he's always had trash attire. (laughs) Yo, but nobody says nothing about Jordan because it's Jordan. Because it's Jordan. I, I understand that. But why they trash other people then? Because they're not Jordans. How you gonna trash somebody and they got Jordans on their feet? You can't trash Jordan for that, bro. You, you, you can be, you can be objective. Nah, you don't you, have to be biased. Even Republicans buy shoes, man. <laughs> right? Jordan. He did say that, didn't he? Jordan.